Hello everybody, let's play Minesweeper here, welcoming you to the first episode in my new Let's Play series of Medieval 2 Total War. I said I was going to do a Total War game, and to be honest, I said I was going to do Shogun 2 at the end, but it didn't work out. I'm sorry if you get disappointed, but as for right now, um, Shogun 2 is for me crushing too much. Crashing, not crushing, crashing. Um, I don't want to rant about this too much, but I, I I just gotta tell you that I can't I can't let's play it because of the crashes. It would get too annoying, and uh, hopefully that will be fixed in the future. And uh, one day I want to do a um, let's play of a campaign in Shogun 2. But for now we're doing Medieval 2, which is a cool game as well. Grand campaign, and we will be playing as the Holy Roman Empire. I think that got the most votes on my voting thing anyway, either that or Spain. But I want to go with the Holy Roman Empire anyway. And the campaign rules short, limited. To, uh. Ah, this is a dilemma. I don't really know what I want to choose. Either... Hmm. I'm actually gonna go with a short campaign. Um, just because it's it's a let's play and I have seen let's plays of Total War games that go over 200 parts if there is a long campaign. So, um, 20 regions should at least be a hundred parts anyway, so it's a pretty it's gonna be a pretty long let's play however you look at it, but um, Yeah So hopefully that will be okay with you guys Otherwise maybe in the future we'll do an, another campaign in this game. I don't know. We'll see how popular this gets and how fun uh, I think it is so hmm Battle difficulty is going to be medium, but I think I'm going to go with a hard difficulty on uh, the campaign. That's usually what I go at, at least on, in Rome to War, which I'm playing a lot more than this game for some reason. Um, I don't know. I don't know which which is best, uh, Medieval 2 or Rome. I think Rome is a little bit better, but I mean, hmm, it depends on which era you like the most, I suppose. But Anything else we should uh, change here? No, I guess not. Let's start this. The Holy Roman Empire stretches across a vast expanse of Europe. Ruled over by the Emperor, who is crowned by the Pope himself, the Empire's influence is strong and far-reaching. From the moment that Charlemagne was crowned Emperor, the soldiers of the Reich have fought and died for victory. Yet war, even when waged by a holy Empire, is still a brutal affair. It is the Germans who wield the most power in the Empire. Though it exists as a shadow of what once was, it will take a great general to lead the Empire to its former glory. That's me. Okay. So this is starting now with even more cutscenes. I mean, this is total war. I don't want cutscenes. I want loading screens. And of course, campaign maps and epic battles. Summer, 1080 AD. What does not destroy me makes me strong, says John Milton. And I agree. I agree. Guten Tag, Emperor. You are in command of the powerful Holy Roman Empire. 
Yes. Although the Holy Roman Empire is strong, it is surrounded by enemies. You will need to contend with the French to the west, the Italians to the south, the Danes to the north, and the Poles to the east. You should first strengthen your position by conquering the rebels to the northeast. Yes, Prague the is town of gonna Prague die. Make an ideal first target. Okay, screw it. I don't want more uh, tips from you. Ah, well, I start with uh, what is it? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Um, six um, places or. Hmm, what's it called? Um, locations, whatever. Which is nice. Um, because, yeah, let's recruit some town militia here. We need to get, you know, our armies up a bit. And I guess... Diplomats is very good too. And why not a merchant? Yeah, holy I have a priest here. He can... Do you have a priest? Uh, no, servant. let's go in. in God's name. Stay here near Nuremberg. Nuremberg um, and uh, Stauffen, you have a priest? No, then let, let's get you a priest. Hmm, you can't get a priest, but you can get some nice mounted sergeants. Um, hmm. Type melee. melee. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with that, the cheaper option, because I'm cheap like that, and I need to kind of. I don't need to save money, but I need to be, you know. Uh, watchful of my economy and build a small chapel because I want the church on my side you like me a lot why is the can't I turn oh yeah it's a castle sorry <laughs> I played too much um, room oh you can get me lights because I like you more in this bug and I'm kind of afraid of the guys down here something interesting to bring to the um, table perhaps don't do I have no diplomat whatsoever? Oh, you can get a diplomat. I would like to get an alliance with uh, uh, with uh, the Hungary um, uh, uh, with Hungary and maybe Venice as well uh, because I don't want to fight a two-front war. I want to focus on taking down Denmark and a little bit of Sweden here. I think Stockholm is over here, which where I live. I'm gonna take care of Stockholm and Denmark. Fucking Danish. Weird ass talking. Um, and France. I have never had any problem with France. Uh, of course, I say that, and I and. This, France is probably gonna kick my ass now because you said that, but uh, France is usually pussies in this game and go down easily as fuck. So I will try to take care just take care of France if the Pope doesn't deny me, and uh, maybe move down and take a bit of Spain. And also, this is gonna be a two-front war, but maybe I can, you know, sign a. Uh, this treaty with uh, the Polish over here if they are too much problem. If there's too much problems with Hamburg. You don't have that many. Yeah. I'm gonna Kaiser. go Yo, out Kaiser. and um, go out here with uh, Dietrich von uh, Saxony. A decent general, maybe. And I'm not. Ja, I don't wanna recruit any. Ja, I'm on Kaiser. And you can join up Mart. with uh, Mr. Dietrich von uh, Sachsenson, or whatever he was called, something like that. And you can take uh, Hamburg together. Ja, Nuremberg should uh, get a small church as well. I want. Poop on my side because I don't want him bitching when I'm trying to take off France or Denmark or something saying oh, stop that or I will make you uh, make annoying accusation about you and everyone is gonna attack you bleh no I don't want that I want the Pope on my side I hate the Pope and uh, yeah hmm so 
my guys can't use condoms because that would piss off the, co uh, the Pope. Oh snap! Oh god, that was bad. That would that was bad. I have to admit. Um, anything else I need to do? Blogna, how are you doing? I don't really put up the tax rate to high. I guess. Stuff and how you doing? Uh, yes, I already checked there. They like me. They love me. To be perfectly honest, you can't because you're a castle. Nuremberg them. Uh, yeah, you like me as fuck. Let turn up the tax rate to very high. You, Frankfurt. I uh, moved out an army, so yeah, you have military. I oh shit, that's something I forgot to do. Make it so. Uh, I can manage all cities, not only the ones with generals in, but fuck it. Whatever, I will just do it like this. Um, okay, end the turn. Hello, Venice. What do you want? Trade rights, maybe, or an alliance? Greetings. Our people have Their offers trade right. Um, map information, make a counter proposal. I just want to see. Generous. Um. Alliance? No, maybe I don't want an alliance just yet with the. Uh, but generous, make offer, okay. It seems we have reached an agreement. It would yeah, sure. Be very reasonable. Farewell. So I got their map information and trade rights, which is good. Why? Why the hell not? Hopefully they won't attack me anytime soon. And a suitable prince, betrothed the uh, Agnes. 35 year old. Um, yes, I guess he is loyal. He's good. Um, he's very religious, which is good. And uh, he has some shiver shiverly. Or ha shiverly. Shiverly. I'm, I'm sorry, I don't know to pronounce some words. You have to bear with me on that one, but uh, you know what I mean. He can. Uh, Wait. Never mind. Chivalry may be bad. I don't know. But sure. He can uh, join. Target. Hmm. Council of. Uh, take Rebel Settlement. What, which red, Rebel Settlement? Okay, maybe I'll do that All before I'll take up. Hamburg then. Joining because. Today's march ends here, yeah, good. We shall then I'll, then I will take Kaiser. Magdeburg. And uh, then I guess I'll move up here to take Hamburg. Maybe, you know, reinforce my army here and uh, maybe get some other people to join me. Here, um, I got a diplomat, which is good. And a merchant. You can move merchants to, you know, things like that and they get your money. Also, a diplomat. Um, order, mein Kaiser. Which will move uh, over here to, you know, uh, get the Kaiser. Polish on our Continuing side and maybe Hungary as well. Well, we take care of Denmark and France. But I might. Hmm. Oh shit, I have no one there. Um, you. Hey you move over Kaiser. to Frankfurt instead before you do that. No, you can't recruit a diplomat. Yes, um, it would be nice if you move oh, over I here to Frankfurt because um, tomorrow, um, it's a better. It's my capital. I mean, I need someone at my capital. Honor Kaiser. Honor Kaiser. Maximilian Mandorf. Wait, is Mandorf my? Hmm, where did you check that hair? Family tree. Um, the Chivros. Prince Henry Leopold Wait, well, who's that? Is he, is he just a... Oh, yeah, he's just a general. He's not a part of my family. Hmm, as I said, I've played too much Rome to the war. Here you can recruit a priest. Peasants, yeah, right, let's recruit some peasants. You, how much... Does Florence have has some Italian militia? How much? Do, 
But yeah, Bologna has a lot of Holy Kaiser. A lot of people Your in win. it. So I'm gonna Kaiser. take all the townlish and everything. Let's go and take Florence. We will conquer this honor, Kaiser. Because Laying Florence siege, would be Kaiser. very nice to get it's as to fast the voice, as possible Kaiser. so no one else gets it gets it. And uh, you can move down to tax rate to low until Oh, we can't get a new peasant there. Uh, yeah, we have 150 peasants, so that's nice. Um, anything else we should do? We're kind of low on money. Maybe I shouldn't spend... For the Reich. I spend that much on troops. But it's nice to have, nonetheless. Honor, you get to Frankfurt. Resting okay, here, let's end this turn. Okay, the Venice are doing something. They're getting a lots of troops uh, down here. Greetings. I come bearing word for you today. Oh, nice. Trade rights map information. Alliance. I have no qualms with this plan at all. Good. Then we have an alliance Goodbye. with um, I look the Hungarians. To next meeting. So they won't be a problem and Maybe that wasn't the best idea in the world because I could have, you know, just taken uh, Hungary. But I don't My want to, you know, focus too well much on that. Maybe I should focus more on Prague. Oh, I have a minus. Okay, it's time for us to, you know, start getting some sentiments ja, here. Kaiser, marching to battle. Ja, Kaiser. We lay siege at once. Wait, let's see here. Uh, no. Okay, like this then. Is it time to assault the wall, Magdesburg Kaiser? is going to be mine. And uh, Florence, will I be able to take it? For your honor, Kaiser, we assault. How is the odds? Yeah, so I'm gonna fight this battle. The fight first the battle we fight in this Kaiser's game. Name. And battle. I'm not the best at these battles, I have to be honest. Um, I have won some heroic battles, and this is only medium difficulty, so I should be able to win. I say that now, but I'm probably gonna die. But my tactics aren't always the best, and I think I am kind of uh, impatient with uh, this. So, well, hopefully I will do all right. They only have uh, three walls as well. Your siege equipment is automatically attached to 